up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Bullets Gotti. Word on the street is Trainer Matt got caught lacking out here. Now, I got word from my sources in the streets. They told me son got jumped. Now, this is what happens when keeping it real goes wrong. Right? Keeping it real goes wrong. Instead of Trainer Mac, Humbling himself, mind his business, stay out of certain politics. He continue, 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 continue to troll. And that's why I said in my last video, enough is enough. And now, they caught China Mac lacking. You know what I mean? And I can't feel bad for him because he was trolling. He trolled. Trife, he trolled Troy Ave, he trolled Hassan, he even trolled me. He was trolling mad dudes. And when you troll dudes, there's dudes in the streets that love these people. And you don't know where, whatever direction it come from. Listen, I'm going to keep it real. I don't have situations where it got spooky, but my spidey senses tingles, you know what I'm saying? And I'm one of them 48 laws of power, all the war type of niggas. And I know how to get out of a situation, you know, without a scratch on me. And, you see, Trainer Mac, all that trolling and keeping it real goes wrong, behavior caught up to him. Caught up to him. Now, I don't know who jumped him, but he got a big bruise on his neck. He already got pounded out by AD and Cali. So for niggas to catch him lacking is because he was on YouTube trolling, talking about, yo, I'm going to Troy Yash. Like, listen, man, it's a lot of dudes out here that love Trife Gangster, bro. It's a lot of dudes out here that love Trife. There's a lot of dudes out here that, that love certain people, bro. And the Trader Mac think everybody is Miko Worldwide. Everybody's not Miko Worldwide. Everybody's not AD. Where you could squash, fight it out, and squash, and nothing happens. Everybody is not, you know, Lil Pump. Certain dudes out here is going to get at you. And everybody's not Jim. I'm trying to make them understand that all that talking he's doing, all that tough Tony talk, minding dudes' business, getting involved in that whole Troy Ave thing. A lot of dudes that love Troy Ave. Yeah. A lot of dudes that love Trife. So, and dudes been not feeling China Mac. So a lot of dudes out here want to step to China Mac. Just cause. He thought about, you know, that whole dissing Hassan, dissing Charleston White. You know, me and Hassan, we going through what we going through. But I still get that man his respect. You know why? Because... You ain't see nobody put any cuts and bruises on Hassan. I get that man his flowers. Even when me and him going through what we going through, I still get that man his flowers. You don't see a scratch on him. You know, dudes ran down on me one time, two times, right? Y'all seen on YouTube, but you have never seen a scratch on me, stab wound, a buck fifty, none of that. No cuts, no nothing on my face. You know why? Because I move a certain way. You know what I'm saying? Trainer Mac doing all this. The lip service. The lip service. The lip service. On the videos talking greasy. Talking greasy. And niggas pulled up and did whatever got got to working on homie. You know, I, like I said, enough is enough. China Mac need to humble himself. You know, dudes running down on him needs to humble him to shut his mouth. Cause zip with the drip not gonna help you. All these other real dudes that you supposedly run with, China Mac, where they at? They not helping you. So, what China Mac need to do is just shut his mouth, man. Like 1090 Jake, shut your mouth, man. And just go back to Cali, bro. Because you playing out here in New York like dudes is soft out here, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, B.I.P. to my brother Shaw Dukes. That's a real one, right? You run around like you was Shaw Dukes. 
See, when Shy Deuce got jumped, he still was coming to the bitty. You know what I'm saying? He still was coming to the town. You know why? Because he really about that. Certain niggas is got that lion energy. You know what I'm saying? And then you got certain niggas that just is tough because of who they around and who's co-signing. And China Mac, me and dudes to co-sign him. That's how his gangster, his solidify. Like, one thing I respect about Jin, Jin ain't out here trying to say he the toughest, roughest Don Dada. He ain't, he ain't doing that. But China Mac, you say you the toughest, roughest Don Dada. And now, look what happened. They caught you lacking, and they just showed you that you're not really the toughest, roughest Don Dada. It is what it is. See? I always tell people, man, mind your business, be safe, live your life, man. Because this could have been anybody, bro. This could have been anybody. Look how they call China Mac lacking. <laughs> it's crazy.